If you want to take your family somewhere this holiday season where they can look around and be like, man, I wish our home looked like this, dream on right here inside the Stetson Mansion. Just past these gates is a holiday experience you may have never gotten anywhere else. There might be some Santa panties showing. Okay, there's that, but there's also the fact that this 1886 mansion, once belonging to famed hat maker John Stetson, has been dressed up by this man, J.T. Thompson. Every morning when I wake up, I wake up to some of the most spectacular architecture in the country, and I just have to stop myself and say, wow. The funny thing is, it's usually the guys that give the most reaction, because most of the men are being forced here by their wives, and it's the guys that you suddenly see them stand up straight, take a breath, look at their wives, and kind of like, all right, I might be able to handle this one. This year has been particularly emotional for Thompson, and he used that to create this frosty, embellished wonderland. Myself and my partner, Michael, we, I lost my mom, he lost his sister, but we wanted to, instead of make a memorial or more than we want to celebrate their lives. Check out this library and music room, saturated with rich colors like crimson and gold but a little bit of an edge to it also. You have beautiful uh, glass ornaments hanging from 125 year old uh, handcrafted beams. Thompson says thousands of people tour the mansion every year and it's now attracting international guests. You know, the whole Virgo OCD thing comes in really handy again this time of year because what took me three and a half weeks would probably take any normal person about four months. That wasn't a little bit, so. Welcome to the Stetson Mansion. <laughs> In Delands, I'm Central Florida On Demand's Allison Walker for News 13.